And Minion Land at Universal officially opens tomorrow. So David Martin. Of course. Of course. He's giving a sneak peek today. <laughs> he always gets the behind the scenes tours before everybody else. And he's joining us live from the park this morning. Hi, David. Hey, David. Full disclosure, ladies, I have not been on the new attraction yet. I will do that in a few minutes because I'm excited, but I have not been able to yet. We've been busy doing television with you and celebrating back to school and celebrating the new Minion Land that opens up in about 24 hours here at Universal Studios Florida. It is my extreme honor and pleasure to introduce you to Carson Luter, who is a member of the creative team here and really one of the folks overseeing this entire Minion Land construction and expansion, correct? Correct, yes, yes. Do you like the movies? Are you a fan of the whole I am franchise? a huge fan of the movies. I have been for a long, long time. So it's cool to kind of play in this world of, you know, crazy villains and wacky gadgets and weaponry and everything. Yeah, it's funny you said that because Despicable Me, the first one, came out years ago now, right? 2008? Yeah, we're getting up there in age yeah, now. And so uh, a new product keeps, keeps coming out. And with that comes a new land here. We are standing in what exactly? So this is the, the trade show floor of Villain Con. Villain Con. Yeah, like a Comic Con, like a Mega Con, but for villains. Exactly. Exactly. Uh -huh. for, for, specifically for a supervillain. So we're right in front of Malicious Motors, which is where, you know, if you're a supervillain, you need a cool getaway car. <laughs> you want to customize your vehicle with all kinds of, you know, weaponry and rockets and gadgets. You go, you go to Malicious Motors to get your, uh, nice. your your ride rigged up, right? Those would fit well down here in Florida, indeed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, what else we have here? So over here, this is Unlawful Outfitters. This is where you're going to go to get all of your different gadgets and weapons. And of course, right here, we have on display the, the famous Eliminator X Blaster that guests are going to get in uh, just a minute here. And that's what we use on the attraction. Yes. So this is fully interactive and you're going to step onto the moving walkway holding this and you're going to get to cause all kinds of destruction and mayhem and chaos as you battle the vicious six. And guests are on the moving walkway the entire time? Entire time. Yep. It's oh. a five and a half minute experience. Wow. Yeah. That's kind of long for theme parks, you know, right? Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes people complain the rides are done too quickly. Or... Yeah. We give you plenty of time to, nice. to interact with each of the scenes. What's over there in the red part of the uh, villain kind. So that is Diabolik Boutique. Oh. That's where you're going to go to get your kind of villain uh, outfit. Yeah, that's where I thought Amy and Danielle should shop this morning. <laughs> Fits their personalities. Diabolik. No, I'm kidding. And then, uh, of course, you are expecting a, a large crowd tomorrow, right? Because it's opening day for you officially. I know you've had some soft openings, some pass holder sneak peeks. People are liking it. Yeah, and, you know, hoping to catch people kind of like a back-to-school celebration real quick. All right, let's make one more trip to Universal and check out the new attraction, <laughs> the new land, right? There you go. Before yeah. Halloween Horror Nights is yes, for sure. Exactly. <laughs> now, this is where you pick up the blaster, right? The yep. Eliminator X, as they call it. Yep. Even this is on a moving walkway, so to speak. Yeah, we came up with kind of a creative way to, you know, keep throughput and get uh, guess their blasters uh. quickly. And then after you get done blasting away and causing mayhem, it's time to eat. And we featured the Minions Cafe in the last hour. Oh, yeah. Fabulous array of dishes and food prepared by the chefs here at Universal. This is really a nice expansion. Yeah, yeah. We're super excited to, you know, expand the partnership that we've had with Illumination for Despicable Me, uh, Mini Mayhem, which we've yeah. had for a couple years, and, you know, keep telling new stories with the characters and giving our guests opportunities to, you know, meet the characters and dine on food that's themed to the characters and, you know, kind of live their full Minion experience. It's what you all do best. Well, yeah. congratulations again, Carson. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. All right, Danielle and Amy, you're uh, done in about 20 minutes. We'll see you at Universal Studios. I can't <laughs> wait. I hope I have to get there. Yeah. About 20 minutes. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> bananas, David. Make sure they have like uh, lots of extra bananas for us because we know how much the minions love them. They have I plenty of you. bananas for you. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I know you love them too. <laughs> Thanks, David. Thank you, David. All right.